Hi, this is Michael at TV Radio 1972 with another radio review. The Sony ICF-36 Weather TV FM AM 4 band radio. I bought this radio back in the early 2000s, around 2001-2002. I don't even remember where I bought it or how much I paid for it. I just remember that I bought this radio back then. This radio looks very similar to some of the later radio models, including the Sony ICF-38, which is FM and AM only, and even QFX has a similar-looking radio, which includes AM, FM, and two bands of shortwave. Looks very similar to this. Now, um, let's go over the dimensions. 9 inches in length, 5 inches in height, and a depth of 2 and 3 quarter inches. It has a 24 inch antenna and a speaker size of 3 and a quarter inches. So, let's look at this radio, shall we? We have the Sony logo here, your speaker here. Excuse the appearance on this radio, it's been uh, pretty used over the years, and... This is probably all dust stuck in the little holes here over the years. But I digress. On the right, you have your tuning light here. You have TV High, Weather, and TV Channels 7 to 13. And TV Low, Channels 2 through 6. FM uh, 80 to 108. AM 530 to 1700. You have your band selector switch here. On the right, you have your tuning wheel here. You have your tone control switch here. You have your volume wheel here. Your headphone jack here. And then um, on the back of the radio, you have a Venny case here. Information on the Sony... ICF-36 is right here. A battery uh, door here. Which holds the uh, four AA batteries required to operate this radio. Or the AC cord here. That's pretty neat. Now, nothing on this side of the radio. And on the top of the radio, you have your 24-inch antenna here. And... A nice little handle here. Pretty neat. So what I'm going to do right now is turn on this radio. And I'll start with FM. separated from her child here in the States in 2018. We're talking Miguel. Here he is with the door, and I'll put the link up so you can see that video that I made. That is Bleed Through from 107.5 WBLS in New York. And that's kind of common with some of these Sony radios if you have TV band on it. You'll have FM frequencies bleed on or imaging on the lower TV band. <laughs> Shortly before 7.30 a.m. Monday. Minnesota questioning Attorney General nominee William Barr at this time. Tuesday, in light of the 
Sunday as temperatures warm. Things will transition. He called us adulterers. Can't let it go. So no, it's one of those ghost concerts, perhaps. I like the, the fact that there's a tuning light here. Shed some light about eight o'clock. Angie, DJ Ty Boogie on Power 1051. By who knows? It's an anonymous composer. Play the station that's always on at work. No, no, no. Just say it like this Alexa, play 106.7 Light FM on iHeartRadio. Ditto. <laughs> Good effort. Greenberry, Greenberry. FM is still pretty good these days. It's holding up for this radio. Um, so, especially if you want to listen to FM, locals and semi-locals mainly. Uh, I did get a couple of distant stations, including New Jersey 101.5 from Trenton, New Jersey, which is over 50 miles. So, it can get a few semi-distant stations. Now, I'm going to switch over to the TV band. Because um, the lower part of the TV band, I actually get some bleed through or imaging from FM stations. So I'll switch to TV low. And you'll see what I mean. Starting around channel three. Again, he is, he's maybe in the position, he's on the outside. I am right here where the Senate will be the jury in this. They shot the JC. It's got two in it. Ramos on Z1. A snowstorm. Young and anywhere. Young and anywhere. I'm freaking out. And, yeah. That's WNYZLP 87.7, New York City. Uh, that's a Korean station. And that's the actual uh, audio for Channel 6. So, yeah, some bleed through from the FM, but this is the actual frequency for WNYZLP, Channel 6. Now, I'm going to go over to TV High. You're not going to get anything because of... Um, my weather station is still off the air. It's been off the air for more than a year. KWO 35 New York City. I have to go 27 miles on some of the better weather rails in order to even get a weather station now. That And that's KZZ 31 in Hardyston, New Jersey, which I won't get on this radio. Uh, Sony, one thing they're not good at is... Uh, is uh, the weather band 
the weather frequencies. Uh, that's something Sony isn't good at. <laughs> And that's it. So, that's always been a weak part of Sony, uh, how they handle the weather bands. But um, weather's more of a bonus on this radio than the main part of a radio, so don't get too concerned. If you at least can get your local weather station from a few miles away, I'd say maybe... 10, 15, 20 miles, you should be good. So, right now, I'm going to try uh, the AM. And um, right now, it is about 5.13 p.m. Eastern Standard Time from Northeast New Jersey. So, nighttime coverage at this time of year begins. That's when the daytime-only stations go off the air. Other stations lower their power or change their power. So, it's kind of a dusk scan of AM signals. This is actually imaging from 1430, which is WNSW... Newark, New Jersey, because they live a couple miles from the transmitter. They hear random people. I don't know why. And then their story comes out, and they say, "How?" So that's imaging on 5:30. Seven trumpets, a ram's horns before the ark went before continually. See, you should never squander your timeouts in the second half. Relationship, obviously. For eight years, America never saw those pictures. I also go to Russia after the RNC in July. This is for a con and show them in the But Barack Obama hang, hung out with the most radical people in the Chicago area. Try to see if I can get 740. <laughs> so that's get, another dot that has to be connected. Yeah, I guess I can't get Zuma radio right now. On behalf of Trump, or rather in coordination with President Trump, that has yet to be proven. So two separate... You know, I don't think it's unique to... to Congress and the allegation that Democrats and the leadership and the importance of this project. That might be 900. CHML, Hamilton, Ontario, Canada, 337 miles. This is doing very well. Health Commissioner Dr. O'Connor, 6 a.m. And then the deep freeze that's going to encase everything and possibly bring power outages. We'll be walking. I'm going to see if this is 10:30. The weekend here on WBZ. Up. WBZ, Boston, Massachusetts, 191 miles. How are you doing, Brett? You know, I, you've dealt with Governor Hogan before. He's one of the most pragmatic governors that you've had here in Maryland. So I don't think he's running in 2020, Don. He's running in 2024. And he's already a roadmap for his tour. How's this problem? WBAL, Baltimore, Maryland, 167 miles. No interest to give a slight lean to Kansas. Well, he's no more liberal than just New England. Mm -hmm. Back and forth. The, the, the one of the big things is I think that's eleven hundred. Inability to play on the road this year. They, I mean, they've really, they've really played very poorly on the road. In fact, between home and away. WTAM, Cleveland, Ohio, three hundred ninety-four miles. Thank you. 
WBT, Charlotte, North Carolina, 533 miles. 45% of us. Struggling with your mental health right now? You can make a big difference with just four little words. Hi, how are you? One simple question goes a long way in showing someone you care. January 22nd is Hi, How Are You Day. A day to fight the stigma against mental health struggles. WHAM, Rochester, New York, 238 miles. I don't know. It doesn't ring true. That's all I can say. It just doesn't ring true to me. The idea of Ivanka Trump going to Russia, moving her family to Moscow, to live in Moscow. Yeah, these young kids, he's... he's WPHT, ever. Philadelphia, no, Pennsylvania, he's 82 miles. His family, especially, they're very involved. An organization called Promise Keepers, and there was a guy who would speak right before me every time. He always said his name is Gary Rosberg, and you probably had him on the show. He's a great guy. He and his wife wrote a book called The Five Sex Needs of Men and Women. The fourth sex need of a woman is spiritual intimacy. It's not even on the list of men. WHKW, Cleveland, Ohio, 394 miles. WMTR, Morristown, New Jersey, 17 miles, Classic Goldies. Escatológico y apocalíptico, 2000. WFED, fifteen hundred, Washington DC, two hundred four miles. That might be 1510. Wow. Already, uh, WLAC, Nashville, Tennessee, 755 miles. And that should be 1520. Did we just meet each other? What are you doing? Why didn't you just do your hit from Pete's piano book? Why didn't you just go down to Old Absence House and call WWKB, Buffalo, New York, 280 miles. If I was clever and cared a little bit less... Of else the most excellent governor oh, that might be 1530. No, that I don't think that's fifteen thirty. I, you know, I think even pain. Then the soldier could, and turn into a blissful, paradoxical nirvana. I'm having trouble with this thing. Denial of reality or something. I, I don't like it. I don't like that might be 1550. Said he, when thine accusers are also WTTM, Linda Wall, Pennsylvania, and Linda Wall, New Jersey, eighty four miles.
That's in a foreign language, so that is actually CHTO Toronto, Ontario, 330 miles. Uh, I'm not getting WPTX right now from Maryland. And that's it. Final thoughts on this radio. Um, if you can get this radio in good condition, um, I recommend it. It does well on FM. Locals, semi-locals, maybe stations as far as about maybe 50, possibly even 60 miles away. So uh, at least in my area, your, your distance and mileage can vary. Um, AM does pretty well, too. Uh, during the day, mainly locals and a few semi-locals. At night, you'll get some distance stations. I mean... After 5 o'clock, and I'm already getting a station from 755 miles away. So it's possible to get some DXing out of this radio. And, um... If you have the weather band, that's more of a bonus. Uh, you can use the TV high band to tune in basically your local weather station. And TV low is basically just imaging and bleeding, bleed through from other FM stations. So, uh, overall, pretty good radio. I'd recommend it, um, uh, if you can get in good condition. So, I hope you enjoyed this review. Have a good weekend, everyone, and God bless. Bye-bye.